uh, going to pop up and it contains all the outlets that we just declared inside the H file and we're going to press the circle uh, over corresponding, uh, corresponding object and we're, and we're going to drag this to our object and we release the mouse button and as we see uh, the name label was just assigned to this label and we do the same with text field uh, and the same situation is when we want uh, to connect an action to some button first we're going to think about what action uh, is going to is going to be done when uh, the this action is going to be initiated so when the user first presses the button and releases it we want the action to be initiated so we select the touch up inside action and we drag this to files owner and this little menu pops up and we press the corresponding action save name now when we want now we want the keyboard to disappear so we select the text field and when the user presses end on exit so did and did end on exit we drag it to files owner and select the hide keyboard now this is all now we save our interface file we quit it and we press build and go and the iPhone simulator just started up and the keyboard disappears and I type my name in here press return and save and my name is Mike cool so this is it for the for building our application so once again what was done here first we declared which objects we're going to use when we want to declare an object we need to write an IB outlet for this object next we tell which object is going to be used used and we choose a name for this object each uh, IB outlet needs a property inside the property needs to be uh, needs to have some attributes and the rest was the same as an in, in IB outlet and we declared some actions over here next each object each object is going to be uh, is needed to be synthesized inside the M file uh, we declared the string inside the save name action we set the string inside uh, the name label we release the string because it is not going to be uh, needed any longer and to hide the keyboard we uh, type the resign first responder command well this may look quite complicated is if it is the first time you used uh, Xcode but it's very essential for you to understand what just happened in here if you don't understand anything uh, just try to uh, go over it uh, go over the tutorial a few times uh, and if you've got any questions then you can email me I'm going to help so uh, it's there isn't any sense in moving uh, along if you don't understand this so uh, happy coding and happy new year uh, bye